Good morning. Welcome to lesson 14 of the course Introduction to Rapid Application Development using SQL Server and ESP.NET Maker. I am Benjamin Fadino. In this lesson, we are going to learn how to download and install ESP.NET Maker. In this lesson, we are going to learn how to download and install ESP.NET Maker. Uh, the first thing you need to do to download ESP.NET Maker is to ensure that you have a steady internet connection available. Once that requirement is met, the next thing that you are going to do is to fire up an internet browser like Google Chrome. So I'm going to click open now. Then uh, you search for ASP.NET Maker. Now, click on the link for ESP.NET Maker 2020, code generator for ESP.NET Core 3.1. Then, when you get to the home page for ESP.NET Maker, click the download button. Now, when you get there, you'll be told that you are going to enjoy free 30-day trial. Now, there are, system, there are system requirements for ESP.NET Maker. First, you must have .NET Core SDK 3.1 or newer installed. You must also have .NET Framework 4.5 or newer installed. You must, your, Node, your Node.js version must be at least 10.12. Now, there are some other requirements that you should review. Now, for you to download, you then you fill in your email and then click the submit button. So here I'm going to type in Benjamin SQL Server gmail.com. So I click submit. Now immediately I click submit. The download has started. The download started immediately. I click the submit button. Now the download is complete. The next thing I'm going to do is to click show in folder here. And I'll right click on the installer file and I will select run as administrator. Click yes. I click next and now I, I, I will now select I agree to the terms of the agreement. I will now select I agree to the terms of this license agreement. We say welcome to the installer for ESP.NET Maker 2020.02. Then you click next again. Sorry, you say you, you sorry, it's starting again. So you say you agree to the terms of this license agreement. Click next. Then you select and uh, you select um, install installation folder. Then you click next. I'm not going to select next. This is because I already have the software on my machine. So I'm going to click cancel. So that in a nutshell is the process of installing ESP.NET Maker. Thank you.